Welcome back to Inside Asia again. So let's continue our talk with uh, Professor Dr. Kitty Prasasuk. Um, I would really like to know what, what kind of information that you provide. You know, you have mentioned about the sectoral uh, information. Could, could you please clarify and, and explain more about this? All the information that, that we provide, it is not that in sectoral. Okay. Sec, uh, in sectoral studies yet. Okay. Uh, that what we plan to facilitate more research projects that focus on, on sectoral study, on study of some specific products, mm -hmm. specific sector, because that we, we don't have that kind of information yet, mm -hmm. just for the research. Mm -hmm. But for the information that we, we provided, uh, not only what's going on in ASEAN country, what's going on in ASEAN, but we also provide uh, uh, the research mm -hmm. record. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, we compile research list and book and journals, articles related to ASEAN, okay. so that people who, who are interested in ASEAN, scholars, mm -hmm. students, can have some one center that can, they can count on, mm -hmm. and they can come to, to browse, to search for some research, some information related to, to their interest. So that means you provide the full articles, right? Full piece of writing. For example, uh, you provide thesis, uh, master thesis. The list, the list. The the list. Just the list. I, I, because right? of the copyright problem, we cannot provide everything. Oh, we provide yes. the list. For example, recently we, we compiled the list of research mm -hmm. done by uh, TDRI, the Thai mm -hmm. Development Research Institute, mm -hmm. uh, on ASEAN, and we upload into the website. Mm -hmm. So people will, will be more comfortable to, okay. to gain information about what has been researched uh, mm -hmm. in Thailand about something. Yeah. This, this comes up a very good point because you mentioned about your website also conclude a lot of, I mean, uh, research projects that people might be interested. Mm -hmm. and from your study, I'm sure that you already studied mm. about this. Uh, what are the, how to say, what are the um, priority, you know, of your project? I mean, of your ASEAN Watch that you would like to people to do uh, research topic more than what we have now, uh -huh. and what uh -huh. are the weakness as well mm. of this kind of uh, project the research? Uh -huh. Okay, for the research project. Uh, First, uh, let me put it this way. First, we organize ASEAN Forum. Mm -hmm. ASEAN Forum. Uh, uh, every quarter, every three months, we organize uh, ASEAN Forum and we invite stakeholders mm -hmm. in some specific issue. For example, in, in March, we organize uh, ASEAN Forum focusing on border management, mm -hmm. border issues. And we invited uh, speakers who are scholars from Thammasat and also from the Ministry of Commerce, mm -hmm. and then we invited uh, people from the security, mm -hmm. uh, military, and also from the police, from the Ministry of Interior, from Ministry of Labor, uh, related agencies, and we discuss and we brainstorming, and how can we go with our research direction, for mm -hmm. example. That is one duty that that my project is doing, mm -hmm. uh, and then we will have uh, some develop some research proposal, research proposal, but not by myself. Okay. I invited some distinguished scholars, some, sometimes new scholars who uh -huh. has potential uh -huh. to do some uh, research. Okay. Uh, that, that is our duty. And for your question about the research project that okay. TRF or the Thai Research Fund okay. give priority, first, we can say about the three pillars of ASEAN. Oh, yes. First, the AEC, the ASEAN Economic Community. Yes. Uh, we can deny that is this is the one of the first priority. Mm -hmm. uh, first, we look at the opportunity and challenges mm -hmm. or problem that might arose, might arise uh, mm -hmm. with the ASEAN mm -hmm. Economic Community. Mm -hmm. So we would like to invite scholar to send research proposal mm -hmm. on as I said, sectoral study okay. to focus on some specific issue, specific product, specific mm -hmm. sector, like automobile industry, for example, or electronic industry, mm -hmm. or on some specific product, like rubber, for example, okay. uh, that, that would get the impact from ASEAN community. That is one, one of the uh, pillars of our research. And also, we will not forget the socio-cultural mm -hmm. community issue. We, we have to uh, generate research yeah. on socio-cultural issue as well. Okay. Mm -hmm. So what, what, what about the security issue that you mentioned of the three pillars? Right, security issue, uh -huh. of course, uh, for example, 
as you know very well, we have problem with neighboring country okay. in terms of border, okay. territorial disputes. Yes. So that, that is also our priority okay. uh, to have some scholar to do the research okay. on border dispute, settlement, mm -hmm. uh, management, things like that. That is the security problem. And also another thing that we have just started is also on labor, migrant labor. Okay. That is also related both to economic issue and also to security issue as well. Okay. My bad so, labor. So, are, are those uh, research projects enough yeah, to, to understand ASEAN or oh, not? No way, no way. We, we can never have enough research okay. to understand ASEAN. But we try, we try to be a part of uh, scholars, scholarly work in order to understand ASEAN more, in, in order to prepare Thailand. Mm -hmm. uh, in response to the coming ASEAN economic community. And, what, and what, what is the most critical, I mean, research project? I mean, what do uh, Thai people need to understand uh, the most now? Mm -hmm. I mean, I think, uh, again, I think they, they should understand the opportunity that will arise from mm -hmm. ASEAN economic community okay. and also the negative impact mm -hmm. from the ASEAN economic community. Okay. How should we prepare for the ASEAN economic community would be the, the first priority because it's coming, it's not okay. coming so, in the next two years. Yeah. So what you see is uh, there might be some people, you know, being uh, afraid of uh, becoming one of the members that we might lose uh, our benefits <laughs> or we might get, you know, more benefits. So are there any research projects that show these kind of aspects or not? We have some research projects uh -huh. that show that effect, but only at the macro level. Okay. Macro level. We have only broad picture that, for example, uh, Thailand will be negatively affected in terms of some uh, in agricultural okay. product. If the product, we cannot compete with our, our neighboring country. Mm -hmm. If they can produce the same product with about the same quality, for example. But we cannot have a, a clear idea mm -hmm. how, how many of their capacity of production, mm -hmm. how well they can produce the product. I mean, mm -hmm. we, we, don't, we don't know much about our neighboring country. Yeah. And more importantly, we don't know enough about ourselves as oh, well. Yes. So I think the key words here for, for ASEAN community is that we got to know ourselves, mm -hmm. we got to know our neighbor, okay. and we got to know ourselves. It seems like we, we do have a lot of illusions if we don't do mm -hmm. the research, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Right, right. So this is a good aspect of research. But Sometimes when we study the research, mm. uh, people don't use it. What mm. do you think about this? Mm. That, that is the, 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 the important issue uh -huh. that we have to tackle as well because most, many people, they criticize about scholarly research that mm -hmm. is only put on the shelf. You okay. just do research and then done. Okay. When, whenever uh, the TIF, Thai Research Fund, asks for budget uh, from the government, they will get the scrutiny like that all the time. Okay. What, what, what is, how is it useful of your research? Okay. The, the question always comes. But I think we, we have to uh, develop research from engaging stakeholders. That, that's what we are doing now. I mean, in order to start a research project, we will organize, as I said, ASEAN Forum yeah. first. And then we get commentators from uh, related agencies, uh -huh. not only from governments, uh, from the business sector. Okay. And we hope to expand more to the civil society sector as well so that we can uh, identify the topic that is highly important to us and we need to do research and also that can be useful for us. Okay, so after the break, uh, we will come back again to discuss about the usefulness of the research <laughs> and ASEAN Watch. Stay tuned.